All right, let's open some select. Zero eleven here. And today, got a hobby box. Thirteen fourteen. Panini. Select hockey. Featuring six cards a pack, twelve packs per box, and it's divided in two. There's actually two boxes in here with six packs in each. But in any given box of select, we're getting four autos, six inserts, four prison parallels, ooh, and seventy-two total cards. So select, I've always wanted to open select. Of course, it's an old pinnacle brand from the nineties. This stuff is very popular nowadays with basketball, football, you name it. But here it is for hockey. So select, this product is heavy. Heavily focused on parallels, like literally everything in here, there's a parallel too. Now granted, there's some like Expo exclusive parallels and like Black Friday parallels in here that you can't get in here. But touring card base set, there's some retired stars in there. There's some rookies that didn't get any autos, I guess, are in here as well. There's only 15 of those. There's the prism parallel, I guess the silver. If you find a good name in that, they sell well. Look at that. There's a gold parallels, the tan. There's a black one of one. So that's a big objective right there. Get a, at least a prism of a good name there. They sell very well. There's two different rookies. There's your Rookie autos, and then there's your rookie jersey autos. And the target for me is Nathan McKinnon. Hubert is another good one. 13, 14, exceptionally hit or miss. I believe this is like the first proc to have rookie jersey autos of 13, 14 cropping in as well. But yeah, select. I mean, there's more autos than that. You got your select star autos. They're all sticker autos, by the way, and your youth explosions. So the ultimate pull for me would be a McKinnon rookie auto or rookie jersey auto. Maybe a gold patch to 10 or an emerald to 5. But let's check out Panini Select. And before I continue on, this box costs $200 Canadian. Now, this is a box I've always wanted to open, but when I was looking at opening it two or three years ago, it was too much at the time. I was off like 120. I was like, nah, I'll just get like titanium or crown royal. And well, times have changed. This is actually not a terrible price for this, considering like crown royal is over $200 now. But yeah, let's check out select. Okay, seals off. There's boxes in the box. So half our hits are going to be in here, two autos inside, and half are going to be in here. So six packs each, two autographs per, with two prisms as well. So we got Toronto Marley, Alex Galchenyuk on the front there. I mean, uh, 13, 14, such a hit or miss. The top is awesome, but man, some of the more highly touted players really didn't pan out, but... Here are the first six packs, really clumped in there. Let's check out Select. This is a thick pack, so six cards a pack. Quite a few cards here. Excited to check this out. Even the base cards, if we get a good name from the base, they will sell well. And also, Panini Prism, I should point out, that's a very expensive box. Hockey, I've never opened it, I've only opened Blasters. Hopefully we don't get redemption here, but Brandon Dubinsky, Nicholas Backstrom. So here's a base, uh, nice base there, very foily, I guess. Nice cards there. There's Yuri Hoodler, and looks like we got a something ER. Looks like, is it an autograph? Yeah, it's an autograph, but you got Yuri Hoodler, Yuri Tulusti, somebody ER. It's not McKinnon. Chris Chelios. So there's a retired base, but who is ER? I guess, is it Bruner maybe? Let's just flip it. There you go. Jordan Schrader. So here's our first auto. Jordan Schrader, sticker auto. What are these number two again? These are numbered to 399, 106 or 399. So there's Schrader. Here's a first rounder in what, 09? Like a speedy player there, undersized. Last seen on the jackets. I don't know where he is now, but there you go. There's Jordan Schrader. All right, next pack up here. So there's boxes in the box. This pack is definitely less thick, but hopefully get a prism in here. Joffrey Lupel. Evgeny Malkin. So there's a good name there for the base. Nicholas Cronwall. Corey Schneider. Says traded to Devils on June 30th, 2013. So that was Bo Horvat related, right? The draft pick Schneider, right? But we got our first prism. Ooh, shiny. Jordan Eberly. So there's the first one there. Not a bad name, but not a great name there. Really shiny. These are like the hottest thing in the hobby, pretty much. Right here. Got Gila Fleur. That would have been much nicer if the Fleur were the prism. But there you go. There's the first one there. Get four of these a box and two of them per little mini box. All right, next pack up here. Another really thick pack. They really. Oh, it's a filler card. Okay. Well, we got Sean Couturier, Henrik Lundqvist, Kari Lettinen. Oh, here's an insert. Select future. Jack Campbell. There you go. There's the future of Jack Campbell. Back up for the Leafs. There you go. He's solid. Okay. That one's just a regular one there. Then we have Ben Hanowski, Bobby Clark, and Game Center Live. Okay, we still need another auto from this side of the box, and we still need a prism. So, Jonas Hiller. What the heck do we got here? Zidane Char. Definitely got something here. Uh, Mark Giordano. Uh... J J T S T J T oh 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 I see the oh okay hold on here Marty Saint Louis Patrick Waugh that would be a very nice prism or any parallel to get but let's hope we have uh, some ink here because we got John Tavares whatever it is to twenty oh my gosh let's just quick reveal here bam oh look at that John Tavares select stars auto that is sick there you go Tavares that's awesome captain of the Leafs I only have one Tavares auto I'm pretty sure I don't know what I have in my collection anymore but I don't have much of Tavares so that's awesome right there game worn material as well so 8 of 25 
for JT there. That is sick. There you go. We're probably not beating that pole, but hey, we'll see. Maybe we'll get a really good prism here. A rookie that wasn't supposed to be that great actually turned out to be really good. So really awesome there. All right, next pack up here. So, so far, so good. Okay. We got Zach Parisi, Michael Grabner, and the next one here. Oh, looks like we got a fire on ice or whatever like they're called. Grabner, Steve Ott. And Henrik Sedin, Fire on Ice from Select there. So, there's a Fire on Ice, not numbered. And our next prism, PA Parento. So, another not so great one there. Looking for bigger names, but there's Parento. Had a pretty good career, but there you go. And it says Prism right there. So, and you got Mike Richter. All right, final pack of the first half of this box Tavares Jersey Auto. That's pretty good. But we got David Backus, Ryan Johansson, Daniel Sedin, Ben Bishop. Filler card. Oh, here's one of those rookies. Nicholas Blanchard. There you go. Not a great one there. And Steve Eiserman. Some of those retired players, there's great potential in there to get a really good parallel. So, all right, let's open the second half of this box. All right, let's take the next six packs out here. Okay. All right, let's start off with this pack here. All right, so no filler in this one here. So, probably Prism. Yeah, okay. Come on, good name here. Come on, be like Crosby or something. Cam Fowler, Sergey Bobrovsky, Roberto Luongo, and oh no, Matt Duchesne, and. Ah, Yuri Hoodler. Another fine one, but not exactly what we're looking for. But there's Hoodler Prism. So, nice looking card there, but we're 0 for 3, honestly, on the silvers. So, and a Mike Medano. All right, let's open this pack here. 12 total packs in the box. So, ah, uh, Heater. That'd be nice to get a parallel of him. We got Yor Halak. Got a Corey Schneider card. What the heck? Oh, yeah. And we got a Freezers, Corey Schneider. I think I saw a Mark andre Fleury like this, but gold sell for quite a bit. But there's a Corey Schneider. These are cool inserts there. That one's not numbered or anything. Uh, ben Hanowski and Yari Curry. Also, we're looking for the Black Finite one of one cards. I'm not sure who's been pulled from that, but that'd be cool to get one of those. There's Andre Pavlik. What the heck do we got here? Joe Thorne, maybe like a Youth Explosion Auto, PA Parento. Jordan Eberly, maybe a youth explosion there. Brian Trottier, so this is definitely an autograph. Let's do this, and then do that, and then, ooh, it's rainbowed out. So what do we got here? 25, is that Grigorenko? Yeah, is that Grigorenko? Yeah, youth explosion, prism, Mikhail Grigorenko, auto. So there you go, ooh, really rainbowy there. That one is 20 of 25, so low numbered there, Grigorenko. He's on Columbus now. There you go, that's cool. Okay, we got a few more packs here. Almost done the box at 13, 14 select. Uh, there's Phil. Corey Perry, what the heck do we got here? Drew Doughty and, oh, it's a <laughs> fire on ice of Nail Yakupov. Jeez, Nail Yakupov, fire on ice. Yeah, it's more ice than anything. Ice cold, so. And their last prism, dang. It's Chris Versteeg, so. Another yeah, one there. What the heck is this card behind here? Oh, Pat Lafontaine there. Is the uh, retired player there? Huh. Okay, so we struck out on the prisms. Kind of expected, 200 cards. You have a 4 out of 200, so 1 in 50 shot of getting the player you'd want. But there is Jonathan Taze, Mark Stahl, Mike Smith, Chris Versteeg. Oh, rookie. Jeez, Nicholas Blanchard again. Okay, and Guy Carboneau. All right, final pack. This is a very thick pack. Probably a uh, rookie jersey auto, if I were to guess. Uh, yeah, looks like there's some shine to it. Okay, well, how are we going to do this? We got Rick Nash. There's Milan Lucic. Brendan Dillon, so this could be big. Uh, there's Peter Stastny, dang. Okay, that's the card there. Uh, we got Christian Erhoff. Let me just put that behind there, and then reverse it there, and then put it there. So, ooh, it's a Prism version, so if it's a good name. Ooh, come on, be a good name. Calgary Flame. Sean Monaghan? Nope. Ah, I don't, don't even know who that is. Ben Street. Ah. <sighs> Rookie Auto, the Prism version. If that were like Monahan, that'd be pretty cool. But there you go. That's the 99, 63 and 99. Like the whole Prism thing increases the value substantially. But for Street, yeah, it don't really matter. So hey, that was an interesting box nonetheless. So yeah, guys, there's a hobby box of 1314 Panini Select. I got to add this to the need to find another box of this list because that was a pretty fun break. I really enjoyed that. Got a nice Tavares Auto, so... Yeah, awesome stuff there. Really enjoyed that. Yeah, guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.